Hi, Wrightsville kids. I'm Pastor Julia. Today, I want to talk to you about patience. Has your parent ever asked you to be patient for something when you were waiting? Or maybe a teacher or another grown up? I have to be reminded to be patient all the time. But it's so, so hard. It's really hard to wait for things. I remember when I was your age, I used to really have trouble waiting when my mom would make pancakes on Saturday morning. I love pancakes. And I didn't want to wait for all of the time it took to make the batter and then put it onto the griddle and flip them and all of that. And so one time I saw that big bowl of batter sitting there on the countertop before it was cooked. And I thought, maybe I'll just have a taste of that. Yeah, it's not cooked yet, but it'll taste the same, right? Well, I stuck my finger in and had a lick of that pancake batter and it was awful. It didn't taste anything like a pancake. And I realized that even though it was really hard to wait for the pancakes to be ready, it would be a lot better once they were ready instead of trying to eat it when it was just batter instead of a pancake. Well, I'm sure you know that waiting is really, really hard. But the good news is that today we're learning that patience is a fruit of the Spirit. That means that it's not something that we have to have all on our own, but patience is something that God does for us, that God grows in us like, like a tree has fruit on it. And so even when you're frustrated and really having a hard time waiting, you can know that God will help you to be patient. God will help you to wait. So the next time that you're waiting for something and it's really hard, whether it's for pancakes or your birthday or for Christmas or for another time to come on the clock so it's time to do something exciting, remember that you can ask God for help and ask God to help you be patient. Let's say a prayer now together. God, thank you for making us and thank you for loving us so much. Thank you that you promise to help us be patient even when it's hard. We love you and it's in Jesus' name we pray, amen.